Well, good morning. We'll go back to not just stuff. I thought this was gonna be a chair. The garbage guys were here picking up. There was the leapers. They were here, and I thought for sure this was gonna be a chair. We did get a chair last night, and we're counting it for today because it's still in the trailer. We uh, still have the microwave and the fan in here. Not broken down. We'll have to do that today at the yard. This little guy's heavy. This little, I think it's like a medical rack or something. But uh, we're hoping to uh, get our chairs again today rock the streets and get down early i'm tired man we worked hard yesterday we did uh clear everything out with uh with my thrift lady she took all kinds of stuff so we are um back to um we can do some fresh hoarding again so uh she actually wanted those a lot of you guys said you should have taken those party supplies i know she said the same thing so i'll know for next time every day is a little bit more learning let's get after it not 100% sure I saw this thing. I don't know if it's got, oh, it's a pool pump. <laughs> it's like, I don't know if this thing's got metal on it or not. These boxes were in the way. It's a pool pump. Yes, you can. Oh my gosh, y'all cast iron pool pump too. Oh. Sweet. We'll take that all day long. Possible early morning too for a tree and there's something behind my trailer there. Someone had mentioned these stands, I don't think this stand's very popular. I didn't see this style, but they're like, you should save those stands and sell them. Like, come on, does people really want to buy tree stands? I looked it up. People buy tree stands on eBay, man. It's crazy. People buy everything, man. It's crazy, crazy what people, oh, this is one of those ones, there's a million pieces. We're gonna have to take the box and dump. Um, it's pretty crazy what people buy. Like, is that many people? Losing their stand for their tree? I guess so. Ah, come on, baby. I don't want to take 26 trips. Oh, yeah. yeah, we're taking the box. I don't feel like diving back in there and fishing it out. What we got here? Anything good? Blink wire flood camera light. Ooh. Doesn't sound like there's anything left in here, does it? Nope, not even bits of wire. We'll take the shovel. New plastic or aluminum? Here, aluminum. Anything in here? Nope. All right. Let's go. To tree or not to tree. Could be another tree day, guys. I think it's in here. I'm feeling like kind of, oh, it's in here. I was like, it looks kind of fluffy. It's not gonna be in here. Cheers. And this is a stand. This is the one that sells. That one right there is the one that I saw samples of. It's actually a pretty nice looking tree. Pretty nice looking tree. Probably just has bad lights. It's generally what goes. It's a Martha Stewart tree. No idea, but too tantalizing not to take a peek. Oh, we got anything good here. Oh, there's a little lamp in here. It's an Ikea lamp. We'll take that. A wine bottle. Oh, well, they actually light up. Happy 40th birthday. It's kind of cute. How, what made that light up? Did I touch a button someplace? Oh, there it is. Pink. You good for a 40th birthday, right? I've already done that. Got to be for somebody else. <laughs> what we got here? Ooh, foods. Open, open. Uh, I know, it's just spices though. It's not really, don't need to bowl stuff. Ooh, little paw covers for your dog. A leaf. Come on, where's all the good stuff at? <laughs> Not 
mush. You a plastic. All right. <clears throat> More than we came with. Sometimes you just gotta take a peek. Get in there. We did uh, give her that uh, the Barbie and some stuff from the backs here. We still need to go through there. And I'm still gonna find that pin. It's back there someplace. <laughs> Scott, I will, I find it. I, I will, it's back there. Onward! <laughs> Not a ton, but we'll take pots and pans. Oh, there's a pan here. I sold her these yesterday and she's like, oh, those are perfect. Wish she had more. I'm like, I've got more. I just don't know where they're all at. She will appreciate this one here. Pew. Casserole dishes. For next time. Are you chips? No, I don't know if I want those or not. What are you? Exclusively made in Italy. We'll take an Italian pot. <laughs> Let's go. All right, all right. We got ourselves chair number two and chair number three. And maybe chair number four. I'm not, I think that one is a wood, uh, not wood. It looks kind of woody. But it looks kind of paddowy, paddowy, paddowy. I don't know. We'll have to go take a ride up there and take a look. <clears throat> what else we got here? Anything? <laughs> looks like the baby shower stuff. Uh, I don't want any more frames. Although, this guy's probably Natalie is. Now uh, we're gonna take you. You guys come down here. We're gonna take you because you just never know what the day's gonna bring. Let's see, is this thing gonna fold up, you think? What are my chances, guys? Okay, these ones squeeze here, right? Hey, pull up or down? Squeeze. Oh, dang it. <laughs> it's been a while since I used one of these things. They should squeeze here in the middle. Push to unlock. I know, that's what I'm trying to do, dude. Why aren't they unlocking? Yeah. Maybe that's why you're in the garbage. Ugh, too tight. Push to unlock. I, these ones are actually moving. But does it go down or up? up I think that one feels like it's trying to move one more try push yeah all the locks are stuck you have to uh, pig pile on that and squish her down three chairs two more to go let's just slide up we'll just slide up cross your fingers guys I don't know I think it's one of those Ikea chairs It's not. It looks like the Ikea chair, but it's metal. <clears throat> Sweet. Chair four. We're going to it down to one more chair needed. That's pretty awesome. Morning. All right, let's move. First TV of the day. I don't think we're in the right date, but... Oh, I also forgot to tell you guys, guess what this weekend is? Yep. Baseball assessments. Getting back to the grind. Oh, nine. Not even close. Um, so, assessments aren't like tryouts, but what they do is they have the kids hit and run and do like five, six different skills, catching, running, all that stuff. So that way they try to make the teams even because they do a it's called a draft but it's really they see the kids and they try to make the teams a little more fair so you don't have one team that just totally annihilates everybody else there's always seems to be one better team and one worse team and a bunch in the middle but um 
they try to do that to make a fair fair shot of it. So we're getting ready to kick out baseball again. Time to get busy. Man, that is the world's smallest dog crate. And on top of it, there's a divider in there. This couldn't have been for a dog, right? There, there's feathers in here. It was a chicken cage. I don't know. I've never seen one that little before. That's what she said. Hey, hey. Oh, look at those pieces. I think they're metal. Oh, they're fiberglass. I was like, wow, those are these nice chunky pieces of metal. Not so much. We got a banana 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 from a boat. Not a very big one. But what is that? That looks kind of like mufflerish, but it's not a muffler. What is that? I don't know. Put your two cents in. Let's see. Made in Sweden. Just gonna make sure there's nothing yummy in there that I want to save. I don't know. I'm gonna have to ask Jeffy on that one. Oh, look at this, guys. This is a grill top to a Blackstone. Yes. It's a nice weight. Yeah. Yup. <laughs> We throw this just right, maybe it'll close that thing. Oh yeah, maybe not. All right, are those are these covers got any metal in them? Uh, nope, and nope. All right, let's move. I didn't think this pile across the street had anything, but I was wrong. Look at this, guys. The Double fans. We got a pair of fans. Not just one fan, a pair. And what does that mean? Yep, you got it. We're fans of fans here at Not Just Stuff. So take a moment and smash that like button. We are fans of fans here. Hashtag fan of a fan. All right, all right, we got ourselves a big. Come on out to grass. Come on out to grass. in Delhi. We are. All right. We got to scoot everybody up. Everybody's screwed up. You can live right there. Ooh, that did all kinds of stuff in it, didn't it? Gross pool water. All right, let's do it. Gotta check our little pile over here. We might have something else. <sighs> we got some crutches. Got another chair. Chair five. That was quick today, huh? Sweet. Oh, 
whole bunch of chair or a whole bunch of crutches. Looks like lotions and potions in there. Actually, some food in there too. Fortnite Nerf gun. Seriously, look, they threw our Christmas cookies away. Sending them Christmas cookies next year. Uh, I think that's gonna be it, guys. Probably a $40 gun right there. You go back there. Onward. The stands are plentiful today. Another one. This has got the bottom, but it don't have the top. That's kind of different. Actually, the motor's still in here. I don't know that I've seen a fan like that before. Ooh, real heavy. Come on, get in there. Oosh. There's the paddles. Oh. I'll take you two and you. Best served coal. Anything else in here? Best served cold? Ooh, there's brassy brass in here. Or maybe aluminum, I'm not sure. I'm always confused with these. Jeffy has different mindsets on what these don't look very aluminum. They're kind of heavy. Hopefully they're not steel. We'll have to take a check. do it. But you guys go back in here. Why don't you guys go in there too? All right, let's move. Oh, dishwasher. This is best be the appliance neighborhood. Oosh. Oh gosh. Onward! I shook the box and the homeowner said, it's in here. <laughs> new, for new house. Oh, this must have been in the garage probably. They're like, save this one for the new house. We got in here. Dishwasher, I think. That's what the box says. Oh, she's in here. Look at this big old wire. Yeah. It's a new, new wire. Clipped. Whoops. That's funny. Come on out, bro. I'm gonna have to tuck this up top just like the other one. Okay, you come in here like such. There you go. Heave ho number two. Ooh. Let's go. Still gathering trees. Can we get a stand with this one? I don't think so. Maybe this is one of the ones that needs a new stand. They're like, I got a tree, I don't have a stand. Nope, no stand. Ooh, we got here in this box. Oh, it looks like oh, it was a mower, I think. No, it was like a, a bushwhacker. 
a bushwhacker. He must have got a new one. We got a couple of fans in here. Man, we're clearing out the fans today. Ow, stuck on my glove. All right, come on back up here, brother. That dude's mad too. You guys can come. And you? Last but not least. ka -ching. Onward. The hunting grounds are fertile with fans. Someone must have planted, planted some fan seeds. Because there are fans every place today. They're all over the place. Some junk. Don't fall apart on me, are you? No, you aren't. Still getting some bits. Starting to thin out a little bit now that we're out in the deep six. Oh, this is a like Cannondale. This is uh, or it used to be a pretty, pretty fan jazzy bike. I don't even see any welds. Should be aluminum. Yeah. I don't know. Are we gonna keep this one again? Might be a bike keeper. Cannondale's a nice bike. Let's go. Alrighty guys, we've made it to the yard. We're sitting here in our dry spot. Cause we got guys in here, we're trying to keep stuff close to the pile. Talk to Kev. He's running out about with Jimmy today. Oh, the refrigerator slid back a little bit. Um, I don't even know if he ran. I forgot to ask him if he had run anything yet. I feel like he's been to the yard this morning. Because I think he does Jimmy's Neighborhood first. This is steel, I believe, right? Yes. Shink. I don't know if we're going to be able to get to Jeffy before he comes to uh, non-fairish time, but... Might have to come back after lunch, maybe. I don't know, we'll see. See how quickly we can get this beast unloaded. I'm gonna keep this, because I'm not 100% sure. I don't think it's anything. But I would be mad at myself if I threw away something that was something. I don't think it is, but just to be on the safe side, just to be on the safe side, we're going to keep it. Uh, we got to get our, got to get our pipe wrench. Look at that. It's got like a tank. I wonder if that is to hold the, uh, what's it called? washing fluid whether that's a water reservoir I'm not sure yep torch guy's still here torch it away a lot of mailboxes the mail guy was here today I saw him Who's getting on the scale as I left? Did I leave this in the front? No, I thought it, I might have used it in the garage yesterday though. Hey, I guess we're using the big boy then. I don't see my little guy.
that we must have there in a minute. We're keeping the Cannondale for now. That's a nice looking bike. Come on, baby. You couldn't do it. A lot of ceiling fans I got today. Dinner today. Thank you. yesterday. Holy mac of choice we got a lot of fans in here today. up now.
sometimes it does work. So I gotta go home and take my plugs to them. See if they're worth more than scrap. It's a steel, I believe. Yep. down all these fans and I'll catch you over at Jeffy's if I can make it there before lunch see you in a few let's do some NFJ look he's playing Tetris over here he's restacking pallets looks like fun huh? looks like fun <laughs> Not really. Oh. What are they? Oh, dang it. Huh? Yeah, I cashed out. I totally forgot. I don't know if I got that one with me anyways. Not much out there? Uh, it's all right. I did. I. I I almost got to where I wanted to get, but ah, it's one bigger than that. Son of a biscuit. I don't have those ones with me. Dare it to house. That's why I didn't do it. No, I forgot, but. Hey, you know, next door, it, you can turn in the air conditioning motors with the fan on yeah. for 25 cents a pound. Hey, do it. Oh, I did already. You did already? Yeah. <laughs> Just letting you know. Competition's eking you out. Daddy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, this isn't anything, right, Jeffy? I don't know. It just looked kind of mufflerish. I bet that's off a uh, older Volkswagen. I know better than that. You know, Volkswagen engine. But there's no cat or anything in these, right? Yeah. Alright. I, I wanted to ask before I chucked it. Uh either. I got both. I got both. You tell me what you want and I'll give you what you got. This is all clean here. That one door handle. This? Yeah. What about this? That's probably brass. Check it out. I don't think so. I don't think so. Kind of like silver. Yellow. Oh. That part might be. No, it's still brass. 
That's why it's so heavy. I thought it was heavy, but I was like, no, it doesn't look right the color. Nice. What? Oh, that. It is, yeah. I went, I ran a couple of neighborhoods before I came to the yard. Cause I finished lunch early. And uh, that was the only thing I found. But it's heavy for aluminum, right? Oh, have you weighed the dirty already, Jeffy? Yeah, I have two steps. This bike's staying now. Yeah, I mean this is a Cannondale. So it's a it's a good name brand, but oh, you got it. Endo bininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininininini
it's after when I am filming this, it's it's almost time to pick up the kids. Um, so I was at the yard breaking things down. I wasn't sure if I was going to make it to Jeff or not. And so I basically had almost all the fans broken down. I went to check, do a time check and it was 10 of. I was like, oh my gosh, I got to go. And so I threw the last couple of things I hadn't broken down in the trailer and pulled up to go on the scale so I don't make people um, mad at me for, for uh, dilly-dallying around when they're trying to get to lunch. And Jill was gone. And I see her walking down the path uh, towards where they clock out. And so I beat my horn. She, she just keeps walking. Beat my horn again. She just keeps walking. So I'm like, oh, I'm going to have to drive down there because who's going to check me out? And so I drive down there. I'm like, you never weighed me out. She's like, oh, I forgot you were back there. <laughs> so I picked her up. I brought her back to the scale. We weighed me out, and then I drove her back to where she was. So we ended up, I ended up getting a receipt. I ended up uh, collecting uh, my way out. I don't know why. I, I was just, I guess, out of sorts because I knew I was going to have to come back to uh, work with Jeffy anyway. So we got a couple of receipts. So let's dive into the re first, first receipt here. Tin. That's all we had. Um, because we had to come back for Jeff. 960 pounds. Look at that. Looky, looky, Americanos. Seven cents a pound. We got a raise. Finally. It's been since June of last year that we were at six cents. Jill even said, man, it's so nice to see a different number. I've seen six for so long. Um, so we're at seven cents a pound. Finally got a little bump. So it's uh, 67.20 for the first load. The second load was basically non-ferrous, but we did have um, some uh, steel because uh, Jeffy did have the, the bit to zip that, um, the other half of that pool pump off. I didn't have the right size myself. It was at the half. I said, by any chance you don't have one, do you? So he said, let me check. And he did, so we zipped that off so we could um, get rid of the excess. Uh, and then, then I had basically all the tidbits from before that I missed and some ceiling fan stuff and the other stuff that I broke down. I basically got rid of it. It wasn't much, uh, and I'll get to that in a minute. But let's do the Jeffy thing first. Electric motors. That is the ceiling fans, the microwave, the dishwasher motors, all those motors that I did. 103 pounds. 22 cents a pound for 22.66. Uh, we had five pounds of Christmas tree lights at 26 cents a pound for $1.30. Um, Irony light, we, uh, I was, during the original video, I was trying to figure out why it was so high. It's that bench. That bench was really heavy. What I did is the yard wasn't quite open yet, so I decided to run part of my Friday route that's uh, fairly close to my house just to kind of burn time. And that was the only thing I found. Um, but it was a nice bench, and it was nice that it was aluminum because it pays better. Um, and then I don't remember what else we had that was irony light because I didn't have, we had the banana from the boat. Um, we didn't have an umbrella. I'm not sure. Maybe I, the bench might have just been that heavy. Um, 57 pounds, 28 cents a pound for $15.96. Clean aluminum is all the paddles and pots and pans that have the handles off of them um, and all the paddles from the ceiling fans. Uh, and then the little circle things that I told you guys about the other day when you're breaking down ceiling fans, the part that holds it into the little notch, the little half circle thing. Half the time those are aluminum, half the time they're plastic. So those were in there. Uh, so that's 28 pounds, uh, 40 cents a pound for 11.20. And then we had the little leftover tin. Most of it's probably that uh, the other half of that pool pump uh, because those are that's really heavy. It's cast iron uh, and then some tidbits from the trailer. 140 pounds, seven cents a pound again. That's so nice to see uh, for 980 for a grand total on our second receipt of 6092. And so our first receipt was 6720. So we're just going to round to make my maths easier. We'll call it 60 and 65. So we'll call it 125 for the day. Solid, solid day in my book, um, especially uh, since it was kind of low. It's nice to get all those ceiling fans. That helps a lot because we get paid a little bit better. Um, the non-ferrous uh, was almost as much as the steel, even though we got a raise. And that's awesome that we got the raise so we can start uh, hopefully getting some chunkier steel numbers and uh, really uh, take advantage of that slight bump. So um, that's that. Um, I hope you guys had fun today. I did. It was uh, nice to be back out and about. It's, it's 
nice to be done uh, semi early. I mean, I, I don't have any activities yet. Baseball, like I said, starts this weekend and then it's gonna be cuckoo crazy from that point forward, but I don't have any activities after school today. So I can actually get some stuff listed on eBay. I wanna continue doing that uh, in a very aggressive standpoint because it's been doing uh, really well as long as I have stuff listed. My problem is, is that I do really well for a little bit and then I slack. Um, and then it's uh, all the good stuff sells and then I, my sales drop down uh, to pathetic numbers. So I just need to be good about continuing to list. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up if you haven't already, but I'm sure with all the fans we had, you have probably mashed it multiple times. Just make sure that it's still in the thumbs up and not uh, unthumbed up. <laughs> if that's a word. Anywho, it's not your stuff. That doesn't mean you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy, and I'll catch you guys then.